Right, I didn't do a lot last week, um, but what I did do, I just started putting everything back in. Um, so everything's back together, so I'm pretty much ready. Um, what I need to do now is just change that the seat on that valve, uh, so that's going to be the next job. Um, and the other thing I did, yeah, the other thing I did was um, I uh, added the ROV footage to the other video. Now I'm just going to leave the video exactly the same. So um, if you want, if you want to just watch the ROV footage, it will be at. I'll, I'll put it on um, under here at what time it's on, but it'll basically be exactly the same video except with the ROV footage, which is actually quite interesting. This window had a bit of a leak or a possible leak. Um, general consensus of opinion is that it could well have been condensation, which it might have been, because the boat was still holding pressure. But I must admit, I can see a little bit of salt around there. I'm still going to leave it because it's a real nuisance to take these out. And it is strange that none of the others had had any condensation or anything, but I'm just going to leave it and I'll see how it see how it works out. Right, let's quickly take this valve apart. This was the leaking valve. I've got a new seat for it. It's 17, as I suspected. Let's have a look at this valve. Put the cloth down. Now it's wet. Super good. It's obviously been leaking. Well, I know it's been leaking. I need to say that. Right, I'm at home and I'm, I've got a stack of pallets and a, and a board and I'm going to redo that, um, that mock-up that I did the other day except I'm going to make it out of wood because I need to test whether I can get inside to weld. So, let's make a wooden submarine. <laughs> This is uh, marginally better than the last one. Um, right, let's try and get in. Can we see in there? Yes, I think so. So, this is 650. So, I can get in, obviously. Bit unstable, and to be fair, there's a reasonable amount of room. It's not for. I'm obviously not going to be able to move around inside, but it's so that I just want to see that I can get in and uh, 
and weld, you know, so spin the hole around and, and get around to weld joints on. This reminds me of like when I was a kid, I used to make things like this and then sit in them all day. there's a reasonable amount of room I mean it's not that much room obviously but there's plenty of room for equipment um, it's higher up in the seat obviously than this I wouldn't be this low but I mean, even then I can actually even get in and kind of operate Definitely doable. And the other thing is I can bend my legs to get out. Just. See, so. Where's my slippers gone? Oh, ah, lost the slipper. Particularly proud of the um, hatch. Uh, reinforcement there. Robinson Crusoe would be proud of that. 